Hello you guys, um, this is my Transformers G1 video review on Transformers Commemorative Series Autobot Tracks and and this toy is based on one of the Diaclone car robots of 1984 and released in America as G1 Tracks in 1985 and um, he's and he transforms into a an American sports car, a Chevrolet Stingray a blue coloured one at that and um, transforms from this form into his robot form and this is real cool and got a pic of um, G1 tracks um, on this side of the box and again on the other side of the box and I'm glad I got me two, two of these um, for a special because I'm creating my own special display and on the back um, shows you all the info and tech specs great pic of the Autobots fighting off the evil Decepticons and um, for us we're putting um, still, um, this little um, page here B bit of a book star don't you think you can see all the um, um, Autobots um, that have been released um, in um, in Toys R Us um, um, in the UK back in 19, um, not 19, um, 2005 and 2006 um, which is really, really cool close the book up it does come with a set of instructions which is really cool and the, and the third and track, G1 tracks is error to identify and I'm definitely sticking with just the two um, um, just the two um, generation one tracks reissues, and I won't bother with the third, third one, which is the um, which is the um, the air attack form. Um, I decided not to bother with the um, the third one. I'm sticking with just the two and only, just the two G1 tracks reissues. So I've got the instructions. Putting them back in the box and I'm putting them aside for now. And here we have Generation 1 tracks. And this is one of the original Diaclone car robots. And if you have any Diaclone driver, you can still flip this piece up and fit a Diaclone driver in G1, G, uh, Diaclone G1 tracks. And this is real cool. Give you guys a little bit of a quick 60. And I saw um, this um, vehicle form uh, in one of the episodes of um, TJ Hook, I think. Definitely in one of the episodes episodes of um, TJ one of the episodes of TJ Hooker I think um, when I saw um, this um, the make of this um, this car in one of the episodes and this is I mean if, I mean this car is real cool and it's real snazzy it's real snazzy and it does have a little um, secret emblem at the top here and uh, again I'm not going to bother um, um, rubbing his secret emblem because again it's taking up too much of the video so what you do um, to start off I'm going to get started off with um, his um, got his vehicle form um, got his vehicle form now to start and I'm starting off with his little um, air attack form and bring up bring up the little wings white wings and the back and the back of his wheels sorry, bring up the backs of his wheels we do bring up this little black piece rotate it this way and there we have, um, and um, G1 tracks is not complete. And that's this piece, which goes on the back, like this. And you have these little white um, um, missile launchers, one on this side and the other on this side. Other on that side, and we have G1 tracks and put in his little missiles like this, and his other one in like this. And um, there's um, G1 tracks in his air attack form, and in the and different and as I've said before, I'm sticking with um, just adding two. Um, G1 tracks three issues to my Transformers collection instead of three because if, because as I've said before, the third I'm not I'm not going to buy the third um, because um, I'm not going to buy the third and keep the third in the air attack form. Keep the first one in um, sports car form. My second one in his robot form. The third one I won't bother. So I'm I'm glad I'm sticking with just the two. I'm giving you guys a bit of a quick um, little uh, 360 of this um, this vehicle. Real cool. Now for his robot mode, it's real dead simple. Now his front, this hood, becomes his legs. 
like this, bring it down, and at the back you bring these two pieces to form the feet. Bring them down like this to form the feet. Turn track so turn tracks around. Bring up his little wings like this, and these little black pegs um, form bring out his little hands. And do the same thing on this side. Bring up his hands. Placing his little laser gun. Bring up this whole this whole back piece to reveal his face. And there we have G1 tracks, real cool. And his face is already painted red, and um, his eyes are not um, not coloured if I'm right. And this is um, a real cool um, transformer, G1 reissue. And this has been very popular. And this was this toy was first released um, in um, Japan as one of the Diaclone um, car robots in 1984, and released in 1985. And this is real cool. And this is a must for all Transformers um, G1 fans as well. And I seriously, and if you are a big fan of G1 tracks, pick this. I recommend picking him up from places like eBay, Amazon, Action Toys, Toy Wiz, Big Bad Toy Store. Anyway, anyway, that sells Gen Transformers Generation One reissues. And um, this is um, Aaron. And uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video review. And I'll see you guys again um, real, real soon for more Transformers G1 video reviews.